Right, so we're here at the um, Additive Manufacturing Show in Amsterdam, and I'm here with Niels from Builder, and he's going to talk us through the uh, Builder Extreme um, 3D printers. Yes, um, we also produce the biggest uh, FDM 3D printer in Europe. Uh, it's the Builder Extreme, uh, available in two sizes. We have the Extreme 1000 and the Extreme 2000. Um, the biggest printers are mainly used in the automotive sector, printing huge prototypes which uh, they cannot print with smaller printers uh, on the desktop printers. Also uh, huge bones uh, which are missing from a skeleton, for example. Uh, we have printed huge art pieces for clients, uh, all kinds of sectors the Builder Extreme is used. Okay, so to run through the Builder Extreme 1000 in a bit more detail for you, you've got a print volume of 700 by 700 by 820 mil, which is a really nice size actually, you can build some massive pieces. And the extruder type is a unique dual feed system that's the same on most builder printers. So you have one large nozzle and the two feeds go into it. This allows you to switch between colours in a nice kind of graded way. Uh, the print bed is heated and can go between 20 and 60 degrees and you can print at between 10 millimeters per second and 120 millimeters per second. And this is slightly faster than the larger Builder Extreme 2000. Uh, you have to go a little bit slower on that one. But the uh, layer resolution, really good as well. So you can go to 0.5 and 0.6. This is depending on the nozzle. And the materials you can use are anything really. So um, you've got PLA, PVA, wood fill, bronze fill, PET and flexible materials as well. You can connect it using USB or SD card and the frame is made from aluminium and this is again another slight difference on the larger builder extreme. And to run you through that you've got very similar spec really. The, the main difference you've got a much bigger height in the z-axis so uh, 1,820 mil in height, so you can really do some nice tall objects. And the extruder is the same, the nozzle diameters are the same, the same print bed. As I mentioned before, the print speed, you, could, you can't go quite as fast, but realistically you're not going to be going more than sort of more than 60 millimeters per second to get anything of a sort of normal quality. Uh, so that shouldn't really put you off or be a problem. And the, the layer height and uh, resolution is the same as the, as the smaller one. And again, same materials, same connection. Yeah, the, the slight difference is that the frame is made from powder coated steel. I think I guess this is just where it's a larger machine. They've, they've decided to use that. So yeah, hopefully that's given you an insight into the Builder Extreme 3D printers. If you've got any other questions about them or want to find out some more, uh, feel free to contact us using the uh, comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment and subscribe. Also, come follow us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. You can find out more about our products and services by visiting dream3d.co.uk.